Greetings, folks. My name is Doug Miller. I'm a New Mexico artist. I live in the northwest corner of New Mexico, north of Farmington, out in the country. And um, I'm uh, just a couple of days away from opening my very own studio here at my home. And uh, uh, with my artwork, I, uh, I do a lot of gourd artwork, rock art, sculptures, and paintings. And uh, as you can see here, I grow my own gourds. And uh, here's some of the rock art that I do. I've been doing prehistoric rock styles of rock art since about uh, 1987, I believe. I started board artwork in 1989, and I've slowly progressed from there. And uh, uh, I'd like to invite you to my studio and take a look. I'd like to show you some samples of some of the different uh, types of artwork I do. This is a gourd pot that uh, I call Rhythm of the Rain. Uh, it's inspired by an early Anasazi uh, pottery design. And then I reduced and multiplied it and created this design. It's 100% freehand. No pencils or stencils. That's my general rule with uh, most of my art. There's a few exceptions on occasion. There's a couple of paintings I did use yards to take on, but uh, most of it's generally all freehand. I'm a self-taught artist, so I enjoy the challenges of doing things um, to extreme. <laughs> and this particular pot is, uh, is definitely something that I really enjoy doing. I do uh, a lot of different types of board art, though. Uh, this one's a very New Mexico type piece. It's got roadrunners and yuccas. And uh, like I said, I grow a lot of my own boards, but I'm a vendor at the Farmers and Growers Market, in which case uh, there's been other vendors there that have shared boards with me, and I've even bought a few online at times. Here's another sample of some of my gourd artwork. This particular color combination is part of my Night Vision series. So this is another uh, one of my gourd pieces. I call this design Ancient Friends of the Four Corners, which was inspired by uh, the ancient cultures from the Four Corners region. This is a, a newer piece to my collection. I call it uh, Pinion Mesa, and uh, it's um, inspired by uh, local prehistoric designs, regional. And this is uh, a rather large piece that I've done, which is um, a combination of prehistoric Anasazi as well as uh, prehistoric Fremont designs, um, but uh, still part of the Four Corners region, and uh, I, I enjoy doing uh, things of this nature. The Bigfoot and the Deer painting are part of my Night Vision series. Things like my castle. 
great to ship it. So. This particular piece I call Perseverance Castle. It's all made from hand carved pieces of board. The upper chamber comes off with at least eight tiny bedrooms throughout that are completely furnished with uh, miniature antique style carved furniture throughout this whole upper chamber. And uh, the floor starts off with a 304 piece mosaic starburst pattern double staircases coming up to the towers and balconies. When I started this piece, I had full intentions of doing a castle, but I had no idea what it was going to look like. This was completely freestyle architecture, and this is how it turned out. This is Perseverance Castle. years. Mm -hmm. 